goes without saying, anyone that's seen any clip of this movie, you, Chadwick Boseman, Michael B. Jordan, you guys are all ripped to shreds. You've got, I mean, unbelievable. Is it just like weights are all over the set? Okay, cut, let's go over here and just start going. <laughs> just to make, like, push, let's do 30. It, it all, right it all really but... depends on what you needed. And they created a really great environment where you could ask for what you needed. Okay. So for me, I was working out a lot, so we were doing uh, fight choreo stuff. Yep. A good amount of times. And then I would go home at the end of the day and do a training session. Or if I had a really early call for 4 a.m., I'd have my trainer come and train me maybe at 2.30 in the morning. Okay. To then go in on set. Um, and then also while you're on set before shooting, they had weights. They did have weights. Yeah. So like between takes, you might just like do some curls and some things. Keep it pumped. Just keep it pumped and then go out day, there. Day you know. in the life for me here. Yeah. Every day. <laughs> Every just, day. I gotta pull this suit out. I yeah, well, I could watch those videos on repeat. So. <laughs> and what's the Duke man. and the cast of Black Panther put in the hard work to bring the movie to life? Look, it totally paid off. Yeah, it did. And for Duke, it was a full circle moment in many ways for him, working with his longtime friend, Oscar winner Lupita Nyong'o. Yeah, they met back at drama school at That's Yale, so which cool. is, is really cool. Winston opens up to me about how Lupita helped him prep for Black Panther, which, by the way, is his first big screen role. Watch this. It was just great to really get to work with someone I admired and that I had a close relationship with right. who also served to this is your first movie, this is how you do this thing. Yeah. You know what I mean? Did this Lupita is... have like a really good piece of advice that was the most powerful that you'll hold on to? Um, I don't think it's just one thing. It was just like, I think the support, knowing that she was there and knowing that I could ask her like, hey, what's this industry or business thing that I should really think about? And how, like what does this, stage mean for me and she always gave great advice you know what i mean so it was just wonderful to have that kind of support system show me my respect and bow down you get to decide what kind of king you are going to be in another generation so kids can kind of grow up not feeling like they need to be part of a first in this way that there aren't going to be that those kind of ceilings for them. They're not going to be wishing to see themselves represented on TV. It's going to be a Black Panther, and hopefully this film creates avenues for other stories like this with people of color, not just black people, but people of color. Right. You know, their stories can be invested in, you know, and be celebrated. And First movie role, Black Panther. I'm so excited for him. And then he's going to also be in the next Avengers movie, Infinity War. We're going to see a lot of him. For a second. But I mean, it's just like <laughs> starting out right at the top. How yeah. incredible and, and well-deserved. He is such a great guy. Mm -hmm.